Hello guys and welcome to this video. If you did watch my previous video, you should think about now it's 2 o'clock. It is not. It is 4 o'clock. I had some breakfast and then I fell asleep on the couch. So now we're running out of daylight, so we're going to have to be quick. So the plan is, we're taking Pablo for a walk and we're going to try this out. Now I do have a lot of concerns. This probably won't sit high enough on his back. It'll probably just film his fur. It isn't a proper dog strap, so it's just one strap. So chances are it's probably just gonna slide around. It's gonna film from underneath his belly or on his side or something ridiculous. But we will give it a go and we'll have a look. Because if I'm gonna invest in a GoPro, I wanna make sure the content that I can possibly film with it is gonna be right. So we'll go test it. I left my boots in the car after the fireworks. They're a bit moody. So you just sit in the car until we put them on. Okay. back home now I'm gonna edit together the video now to be honest I don't think that went well at all I think the camera was filming the wrong way around that was my own fault I was playing about with it the other night and I realized you have to turn it like 90 degrees to the way you want to film it looking at the screen and I'm sure my intention was when I set it up was to film it off his side which I filmed off his back and his belly but to be honest the strap wasn't the best when it sat on the back of his neck it looked like it was just recording like the back of his head not kind of this area like just here when it was on his belly, it looked like it was just... You'll have seen the footage already. So you'll have seen it before I've seen it, but I'll see it before you see it. The wonders of YouTube. I'll do the best with it I can. If I generally can't do anything with it, then you probably won't have seen anything. But if I was to get a GoPro, I would use it for a lot of different things as well. Not just for strapping on Pablo. There's obviously stuff you can put in the car and, you know, you can put it on our heads. You can put it on our chests, you know, when you not want to physically hold the camera. There's lots of video ideas I thought we can use it for. I'm not going to tell you them all because I want them to be a surprise and I want them to be a surprise. I don't know why I just said surprise twice. I think the thing I'm going to do though is I'm going to invest in a proper mount so we can get that camera properly on him and lift it up a bit so you can actually see. It is quite big and chunky compared to like a normal GoPro. So it is quite heavy on his back and I don't want it like strain him or anything. So we'll get a proper mount. And then we'll try it again. And then if that's good, then I might ask Santa Claus for one. I think I've been a good boy. 
But that's going to be it for this video. We hope you enjoyed. Drop your comments down below. Let us know what you think. Let us know if you'd want to see more of this sort of thing. Whether it's going to be a good idea or not. Subscribe if you're new. If you're not subscribed to my own channel, the link will be in the description. So go subscribe to that as well. I will just keep self-promoting myself. And as always, guys, peace out. <gasps>